558 holiday shopping is near in one particular generation plans to spend their money offline. But first, Amazon is upping its grocery game. Consumer expert A.B. Davis is here to explain all of this. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. This is interesting news, right? Amazon doing groceries. The company announced it will open a new grocery store next year in L.A. So the store won't be a Whole Foods, which Amazon bought in 2017. So Amazon's not revealing the name or whether the new store will be part of a chain. Huh. The company also not saying anything about pricing or products, so not much. <laughs> um, we're interested because if they do it there, then maybe they'll expand. Sure. Um, this comes about eight months after the Wall Street Journal reported that Amazon was negotiating to open supermarkets in several cities. So no we'll cashiers, I'll one. bet you. Yeah, we'll see. The Wall Street Journal reporting that Google is partnering with major hospital chain Ascension to collect and analyze personal health data from millions of Americans. So Ascension owns a ton of hospitals all across the country. Mm. The initiative code named Project Nightingale. It involves Google pooling medical records that include names, dates of birth, lab results, diagnoses, and hospitalization records. So according to the journal, it amounts to a complete health history Patients have not yet been informed. Mm. The idea behind the program is to use the data in part to design new software that would suggest changes to individual patient care. Generation Z may be the first generation to have grown up with cell phones and laptops, but that doesn't mean they're going to do their holiday shopping online. So anyone born after 1997 mm. is defined as Generation Z. And the NPD group says this group is less likely than millennials and Generation X to shop online. They say it's partly because of their lack of money and credit. <laughs> they don't have any. <laughs> but also they see shopping as a form of entertainment, I remember? I love going. Like, to, my mom's yeah. taking me off and just walking around the just mall. Just walking around window shopping, going in and trying and stuff on. And that's exactly right. They say their recent report shows that they like to use the mall as a spot to hang out, grab We're a bite to, to eat. convert the flea markets back into malls then. Yeah, I know. And, and get them spending some money if those malls are going to survive, right? Hey, speaking of grabbing a bite to eat, what are you doing for Thanksgiving this year? Maybe you want all the feels without the hard work of preparing an entire dinner. So coming up, we're going to help with local restaurants and chefs that will do all the cooking for you from low budget to fancy gourmet meals. We're going to show you how much you can expect to pay and when you need to order. It's coming up, guys.